Hi, I'm Brigham Larson with Brigham Larson Pianos, and uh, I want to talk briefly about a, uh, a concept that we don't really have in English, but, uh, but in France, they're big on, on the term terroir. Um, I became fairly well acquainted with, uh, with French cheese. I spent a couple years in France, um, and uh, cheese sort of became a hobby of mine, and the, and the true cheese lovers and, and wine lovers, of course, I, I didn't get to experience that, but uh, they, they would often talk about this idea of terroir, in which, in which true, uh, true cheeses, and they talk about their bread and their wine, that can only be created in one particular region. That uh, true camembert, for example, comes from Normandy, and it's the, it's the wind and the rain and the soil and the, and the, uh, and the all, all of these things combine together, and you can only make true camembert in uh, in Normandy. And I want to I want to take that and apply that also to to fine pianos. That what you're getting in a piano, you could look at it one way. You could look at it that you're getting a combination of steel and wood and and cast iron parts that are put together and manufactured, or you could look at it in the in these terms of terroir that I'm talking about that what you're getting is this you're getting Prague in the in the uh, example of, of Petrov pianos that you're getting terroir you're getting the the heart and the soul you're getting the hundreds of years of, of artistic expression and um, architecture and you're getting the Austro-Hungarian Empire and the princes and the noblemen and and you're getting Prague Castle. It's a it's a story in a world where, where, uh, where pianos are are outsourced and manufactured and farmed out, and and uh, this part is made there, and the hammers are made there, and the strings are are brought in from from who knows where. You're getting something very different with Petrov. You're getting something that is manufactured 100% in this region. And uh, and it and it shows. I've been around pianos now for for almost 20 years, and and there are certain pianos when I play when I play a Grotrian, when I play a Steinway, when I play a Petrov, I can feel that uh, that terroir that I'm that I'm talking about.